The Central California Regional Obesity Prevention Program is a program of the Public Health Institute. This valuable work is made possible through support from the California Endowment and the Robert Wood Johnson Foundation. What better way to improve access to healthy food for children and their parents by bringing healthy fruits and vegetables to their neighborhood school? This is a school farm stand. It's operated in Burroughs Elementary School in Fresno. I get out here once a week and, and set that thing up and there's always a line of people. So it's working out well. The school farm stand started here at Burroughs back in 2008 through the efforts of parents and the Central California Regional Obesity Prevention Program. In working with the community, we discovered that the community really didn't have access to fresh fruits and vegetables. Um, and the community really needed that access, that convenience. So we decided that, and the community decided that it was very important for them to have uh, something that was not only accessible, but affordable as well. It's a mission that is very important to Brooke Crabtree. He is the director of the school farm stand for Farmers Produce. Farmers Produce was created to bring school farm stands to life, making fresh, locally grown produce available for the Valley's families. It's a lot of fun. We get to work with children to parents, to teachers, to facilitators. It's Every day something special happens out here, whether you're helping an eight-year-old child feed their family, which you get to see them yourself, buy green beans and garlic and onions instead of bananas and apples and things like that. It's, it's amazing. Sometimes it's heart-wrenching, but most of the time it brings big smiles to our faces and that's what makes it work. The whole purpose here is to change the way groceries are sold here in the valley. We've gotten away from the farm, which is sad. We live in an ocean of agriculture, and yet the average meal travels 1,500 miles to get to your and my plate. California is the largest exporter of agricultural products in the nation, but yet we frequently have communities left deserted of fresh produce. CROP's goal is to ensure that communities have access to nutritious options. And we want to expose the children to healthier eating, and that's really what we're all about. We're, we want to prevent obesity. We want to bring healthier alternatives to communities that do not have those alternatives. Oftentimes what we see are communities that are bombarded with a lot of fast food outlets, and we want to change those environments. We want to bring healthier options, and we want that healthy option to be the easiest choice for families. This school farm stand at Burroughs Elementary has opened up a whole new world to sixth grader Ernesto Castro. Now I'm like peony, broccoli, uh, relish, uh, asparagus. The new fruits I like are pineapples, uh, uh, guava, uh, star fruit, and that's all the fruits I've tried now. I don't see the fruit, I mostly just try to taste it in my mouth. Ernesto's father volunteers with Burroughs School Farm Stand as its manager of operations. It's a big job, but he's feeling the benefit not only for his community, but for his family and himself. It's a lot of hard work. You got to be committed because, you know, some days it's too cold, some days it's raining, the, the wind, I mean, it's just... It's a lot of things, so, and I, I really enjoy it. It's worked out for me because at the same time, I've learned how to eat better. Uh, I'm diabetic, by the way, so the diabetes has gone down a lot. I wanted to get rid of it, but it's, you know, it's, it's, it's improving. Um, my cholesterol is down. I lost uh, a few pounds. You can't really tell, but I have. And um, I want to show my son uh, better eating habits so he doesn't get diabetes when he gets my age, you know, so because my dad's got it too, so it's, it runs in the family. The school farm stand is a practical solution to a complex problem bringing benefits that extend beyond these campus gates. The farm stand model continues to evolve and has taken on a different look in communities throughout the San Joaquin Valley. The uh, community has really embraced this project very well. Um, the children love it. Um, the children actually feel like they have that option, that healthy option, and it really ties very well with the school wellness policy as a way of engaging not only the youth, but also parents.
Here are some things you can do to help improve access to healthy food in your school or community. Establish a community garden or convert your nearest corner store into a healthy store that provides fresh fruits and vegetables. Implement a community-supported agriculture program that delivers fresh boxes of healthy produce to low-income families. Establish a school-based produce stand or farmer's market in a low-income neighborhood. The Central California Regional Obesity Prevention Program helps to create healthier communities in California's San Joaquin Valley that support healthy eating and active living. CROP is among a growing number of programs in the nation who use a policy and environmental change approach to help community members gain access to healthy food, beverages, and safe places to be physically active. The Central California Regional Obesity Prevention Program is a program of the Public Health Institute. This valuable work is made possible through support from the California Endowment and the Robert Wood Johnson Foundation.